Hi, this is Bruce Cohen, and today I'm talking about the uh, new legislation in Texas. It's known as SB4, and that's a law that was recently passed and signed by the governor of Texas. It becomes effective on September 1st of 2017, and it includes lots of provisions about immigration law. Big question is, what's going to happen with traffic stops and when people come in contact with the police? And here's the issue. The issue is now police are permitted to ask about a person's immigration status. The fact of the matter is they've always been permitted to ask about immigration status, but a lot of, um, a lot of cities didn't want their police asking because they thought it might affect people when they're reporting crimes and things like that. But the truth is that in smaller Texas cities, this has been going on for a long time where they ask, what's your immigration status? And if they don't see sufficient papers, they've been turning people over to ICE and to Homeland Security for quite some time. But now under this new law that was just signed by the governor of Texas, it's more or less encouraging police to go ahead and ask people that they suspect may not be citizens, which would typically be people of color, asking them about their immigration status. And if uh, they don't appear to be legal, they're permitted to arrest them and turn them over to ICE. But as I said, this has already been going on in Texas for quite some time, but perhaps the, the legislators of Texas want to get some of the larger cities to do it, not just the small towns that have been doing it for quite a while. Um, another issue it deals with sanctuary cities. This is also incorporated in SB4 that becomes effective on September 1st. And what that says is for cities that hold themselves out as sanctuary cities, that refuse to cooperate with ICE, in particular refusing to uh, abide by ICE detainers, which say that once somebody posts bond, if they're not a citizen, uh, the, uh, the county or the city needs to turn them over to ICE. Well, a lot of cities in Texas, particularly larger ones, don't cooperate with ICE. And when somebody makes their bail bond for a DWI or a DUI, they just get released. Um, now, it could be interpreted as a criminal offense if city officials or county officials fail to cooperate with ICE and with Homeland Security. So these are some big changes coming to Texas starting on September 1st of 2017.